Metal Gear Solid was a game that came out when I was quite young, and as being an old game, it tends to be covered in glitches. Let's take a look at one of them. This is called the Vent Glitch. It allows you to skip quite a large portion of the game. To do the glitch, in the very beginning of the game, before you go to the DARPA chief, go over into this vent here. Now, I'm going to mess this up a couple times on purpose to just show it to you. What you need to do is you need to back into the vent just before it forces you to go into first person view. Just keep going as much as you can. Go into first person, look up. I go into first person by pressing triangle, I should say, and look up. And then, stand, stand up. Now you have to do this, you have to let go of up and triangle and then immediately press X as soon as possible. Doing so puts you out of bounds, like I'm showing you here. Once you're out of bounds, you can see I'm in the torture chamber, I'm actually in the cell right now. And what you need to do is you need to go over to the doorway that would lead out of the torture chamber. And as you can see, it starts a cutscene. What? Guess where I am? Yeah, guys, we're in the torture area. It skips all those portions of the game, but the problem is, is you don't get items and you don't get uh, your health, which will make this next part very difficult, as you'll now see. Forget it. Your body also, it starts out. the cutscene from before being in the jail, yet plays the jail before the cutscene. When you've had enough, now let's see what happens uh, when I try and do this part Shall of the we game. Go again? It's pretty difficult to actually succeed in this part. I'm actually playing this game on easy at the moment just so I can show it to you, and I'm killing myself on purpose, but trying to save Meryl when you have so little health is extremely difficult. Not impossible, but extremely difficult, especially on the higher difficulties. And there's the vent glitch.